Hello everybody and welcome on my journey to watch 500 films in one year. The 46th film I watched was Housebound, written and directed by Gerard Johnston, about Kylie Bucknell, who is forced to return to the house she grew up in after she is arrested and the court places her on home detention. When she becomes privy to unsettling whispers and strange bumps in the night, she begins to wonder whether she has an overactive imagination or if the house is in fact possessed by a hostile spirit who's less than happy about the new living arrangement. I really like horror movies from Australia and New Zealand. Some examples are The Babadook, The Loved Ones, Black Sheep, The Ruins and Brain Dead. And this film can certainly join the list of accomplished films from that part of the world. The characters are likeable. Rima Tuiata, who plays Miriam, is especially great. And the film is wickedly comedic, taking a light-hearted approach to the genre. There's a creepy, demonic teddy bear that looks a lot like a 50s Teddy Ruxpin, a fight involving a xylophone and a cheese grater, and lots of opportunity for the audience to jump out of their skins. The film is definitely a slow burner, opting to be selective on the use of gore, but watching until the end pays off both in terms of what happens plot-wise and in terms of how the characters develop throughout the story. I was interested to read that New Line Cinema are planning a remake of the movie, this time produced by Gerard Johnston and directed by another, but I honestly think the movie should be allowed to remain a standalone classic. Housebound is a low-budget treasure and it's pretty obvious that I give it a thumbs up. Please join me for my next review where I'll be talking about The Taking of Deborah Logan, directed by Adam Robitel. Thanks for taking the time to listen and I hope to hear from you soon.